Hey everybody, Rory from ANS Gear. We've got another Condor product up on the table. This is the Condor backpack. This is the Venture backpack right here. Uh, we've got two different uh, colorways. We've got black and then the Coyote Brown. It's got a lot of pockets. It's a great kind of outdoor travel, hiking, um, kind of getting out there into the wilderness kind of backpack right there. So uh, let's open one up and kind of see what we've got going on. Uh, there's lots of accessories. Lots of straps, lots of clips, lots of zippers, lots of everything on this one. So uh, let's move the black one out of the way. We can focus on this one right here. So this is the coyote one. We'll start on the top, I guess right here. So as you can see, this little pouch that's on the outside right here, and you'll see why I kind of call it a pouch in a second, has a lot of uh, weaving attachments on it. So if you have any kind of molly, attachment that you want to stick to the outside of this. You can weave it on. You fit multiple things on here. It's all stitched on. There is no Velcro. So if you have the Velcro style Molly strapping, um, you'll still need to weave it. There's nothing to Velcro to on this part right here. So we can put accessories on the outside, whatever it happens to be. There's a ton of different accessories out there. Uh, we've got some straps down at the bottom. So if you need to run all the way down to the bottom, you can. This little zipper opens up right here. And then we've got kind of just a little open little pouch area right here. So this is, uh, there's nothing on the inside. There's no extra little pockets or anything. It's just a nice open little outside pocket, easy access pocket. And then the top of this pouch unzips as well. And this gets you access to this pocket setup right here where you've got a key loop right there. You've got some smaller little pockets here for pens, pencils, uh, markers, whatever it needs to be. We've got a zippered little mesh pouch. We've got a bunch of little pockets right here. One with a uh, elastic on it. We've got one with a strap. So if you've got something that's tall and needs to sit up there and be held in place with this elastic that's on there. Pocket, pocket. Um, does have a little, uh, open rivet at the bottom. So if this was to get um, moisture in it or something, you can still get airflow up inside there. Or if it was to get a lot of water in it, the water would drain out. Depends on what you're doing with it, you know? Um, but yeah, lots of little pockets. Pocket, 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 pocket. All sorts of little extra little spots inside here. Now this little thing we've been looking in also disconnects and can fold open. And this kind of offers another little pouch right there. Now this pouch is open to the elements out here. It is not uh, enclosed or locked down, but if you've got you know a jacket you wanna throw in there or a sweatshirt, something, and you don't wanna have to get into your bag, you can just pop that, whoop, slide it right down in there, and you're done. Underneath this pouch, you do have a zippered pocket and in this pocket, there is a Velcro um, area where you can attach whatever you want to it. If you've got um, maybe a small holster or something that you want to put in here, or you just need to uh, attach some accessory items to it that do mount with Velcro, you can put them inside here and attach them and uh, keep them secure underneath here. The top does have Velcro, which you can peel off if you need to put anything on there names, whatever it happens to be, uh, just a patch that you like, you can throw that up on the top. Uh, all right, so moving around to the sides. So the sides of both of these are webbing and strapped right there. So if you wanna add accessories to the sides, you can. You have that on both sides. And then we did uh, unclasp these a second ago, but these are adjustable. So if you needed to secure the outside of the backpack, with strapping, you can do that as well. So go top and bottom right here. I'm gonna leave these ones undone so that my zipper can run through here in just a second. Actually, the zipper does go all the bottom. I'm gonna leave both of them undone for now. All right, there we go. Uh, let's flip it over. All right, so uh, the belt or the waist belt, or whatever you wanna call it, is nice and thick. So if you're gonna be doing a lot of hiking, a lot of uh, backpacking, a lot of traveling with the backpack, to have 
um, shoulder straps that have an attachment in the middle to keep them out of digging into your armpit. And then a strap along the waist to really help take some of that weight off your shoulders. This backpack is gonna have that for you. It's gonna be a very, very comfortable backpack to be wearing because it does offer a lot of support. The bottom strap that goes around your waist is uh, webbed as well. So if you wanna put more accessories on there, you can. These buckles are adjustable, so you can make them bigger or smaller, and they are padded, so they will be comfortable to wear. Uh, this part right here, this lumbar support, so lower back support right here, is really big and soft right here. So this is gonna offer a lot of cushion and just a lot of support and a lot of comfort while you're wearing the pack. Running up through here, we have another section of padding and you can see it's kind of channeled right here. So the padding is gonna sit against your back, but you're gonna have these channels running through here, which won't be pressed up against your back. It'll offer a little bit of airflow to get through there because it can get hot and sweaty wearing a backpack all day long. So this will be uh, helpful with that. And then our backpack straps themselves, our shoulder straps have loops on them, D-rings on them, so we can attach stuff to it. We can um, put accessories on there, whatever we wanna do. And then the bottoms are adjustable so we can make them longer or shorter. And we've got an adjustable slide in the middle right here for our chest snap like that. So, <coughs> excuse me, all adjustable. Uh, on the back panel right here. So we've got this part that does open up along the back panel. And this is a pretty rigid plate that's inside here. Now this gives you access to an area that's inside here, which would be perfect for like a hydration pack setup or camelback setup or whatever it happens to be. You can put that in here. You have some things to hang from. So if you need to uh, tether up the, the hydration tube, you can do that through here. You can connect it with these Velcros. There is a, a loop at the top right here. I'm trying to get it so you can see it. There it is right there. A lot of hydration packs have a little hook on the top of them, so you can hook it through there. And then you have a pass through right here. So this little bit of Velcro, you can undo it and then pass the uh, the tube right through there. You can see my finger coming through there. So you can pass it through and it's Velcroed on both sides so you can keep either side snug. You wanna run it through the left or the right. You can do that. Also, this piece right here, which has that hard backing in it, See if I can get it more like, there we go. I'm pretty sure you can open that up and then you can take that out. So this plate would slide out of here. If you don't want this hard backing in here, you could take that out and you can soften this thing up so it's got more flex to it. If you're looking for support, leave it in there. If you're looking for um, a softer back plate or back panel, then take it out. But either way, you can uh, leave it in, take it out, it's up to you, it's adjustable. All right, so moving over to the front, kind of again. At the top, we have a nice carry handle right there. We've got some more straps, some more loops. Um, let's open up the main pouch right here. Where are you? Oh, top section right here, we've got another zipper. I thought I was opening the main pouch, but I was opening an extra pouch right here. So this one looks like it's microfiber lined. Uh, it is uh, gonna be great for like phones, uh, glasses, things that you don't wanna get scratched. You don't wanna damage them, nice and soft. A Little bit of padding in there, keep everything secure. Now we're going there. So we've got that and the backpack opens up. It's nice to have a backpack that opens up pretty wide. It doesn't, uh, the strap, uh, the zippers don't come down like uh, three quarters, so it makes it hard to open the whole backpack up. Uh, these open uh, or come almost all the way down to the bottom, so it allows this to open up really, really nicely. On the pouch flap, top flap section, we have some zippers, we have some pouches, some net pouches, mesh pouches. On the main inside, this would be the back, because this is the front, so we open it up. This is the inside back right here. We have another pouch. And then we have a padded section for uh, laptop, tablet, uh, whatever you want to throw inside there. Now in this section right here, if this was closed up and you really just wanted to kind of get into this 
but didn't want to uh, open up your whole backpack and have to dig through it. There is a zipper on the top right here, which allows you kind of director access, director, more direct access to that slot that would have those electronics inside of it. Again, you can use that pass through to get to any section of that main compartment. But if this was all loaded up and you wanted to get to the stuff behind it, this makes it really easy to just get back here to this section and uh, and work with whatever happens to be in there. Uh, it's a cool backpack. There's a lot of stuff going on. Obviously a lot of little pockets, a lot of accessories, a lot of places to put things. But maybe that's what you need in a backpack. If you're doing a lot of outdoor activity, you're doing um, hiking and running and jogging and camping and all that stuff, it's probably a really good choice for you right here. So this is the Venture Backpack from Condor or Venture Pack. It's available in the Coyote and the Black. Get yours today at ansgear.com.